亚太法律中心今天公布十一月选举加州亚裔选民投票倾向分析初步调查报告，结果显示，过半数加州亚裔选民支持三十号提案，就是以短期加税方式保障幼稚园到十二年级公立教育系统经费不再继续遭到删减。另外，加州亚裔选民也倾向支持移民相关法案，更有七成支持奥巴马总统连任。亚太法律中心已经连续二十年，在每次大选后向加州亚裔选民进行投票倾向分析民调。今年十一月六日，总统与地方选举结束后隔天，亚太法律中心便以英语、西班牙语、中文、韩文和日文等七大亚洲语言，向加州一千八百位亚裔选民进行电话访问。初步调查结果显示。教育始终是亚裔选民最关心的议题。65% of Asian American voters voted for Proposition 30.、Uh, we think that Asian Americans、um, thought that because the economy is really suffering,、um, more people really need to contribute to the economy. And they felt that wealthy people should contribute the most. About 82% said that immigration was important. 50% said it was very important in determining which candidates they supported. We also found in other polls that Asian Americans support things like legalization or the Dream Act. Certainly, disproportionate numbers of Asian Americans favor any kind of attempt to reduce the immigration backlog. 而被视为较关注移民。权益，同时支持增加富人税、改善美国经济的奥巴马总统，也因此较受亚裔选民青睐。A very large majority, 70%, did vote for President Obama, and so they liked his policies on the economy, on immigration, and unemployment better. They felt he would represent them more. 这份报告将继续向加州一万位选民和五千位亚裔选民。做更深入的投票倾向分析，并将区域细分成洛县、橙县、旧金山等加州主要都会区进行比较。完整报告预计在明年出炉。